A local pianist known around the world for his music is finally back home after spending weeks in the hospital with COVID-19. Ignacio Herrera, who is known as Nachito, spent two weeks in the ICU. WCCO's Kate Raditz shares how quickly Herrera went from feeling fine to critical condition. That period I was dying almost like in 14 days. I can't remember anything. Ignacio Nachito Herrera came down with a severe cough on March 27th and quickly became disoriented. The next memory he has is waking up Easter weekend at M Health Fairview U of M Medical Center. This is not a simple cold. Not at all. The renowned jazz pianist grew up in Cuba, where music was always part of his life. My uh, father used to have actually a big band in our on the town we used to live. And so I grew up listening to music all the time. He learned to play the piano, and his talents have since taken him all over the world, including his first performance in Minnesota at the Ordway in 1996. He would find his home and have a family in White Bear Lake. After 53-year-old Herrera tested positive for COVID-19, he finally got to go home to family in mid-April. And immediately started playing again. Obviously, uh, you lost a little bit of uh, coordination in your finger with your brain, um, but that's something you have to have faith, like uh, it is going to go back the way it's happening. Herrera is out of work right now with concerts on hold, but he's still making music, a new song called Esperanza, which means hope in English. Herrera says he's grateful for the support of his church community during this time and hopes others will find some comfort in his music until he can play in person again. Music is always uh, uh, a language held to like to heal. Kate Raditz, WCCO 4 News. Harara's family says they're grateful for the doctors and the nurses that helped save his life. Harara also gave consent to have his blood tested for antibodies at the University of Minnesota.